All right, so part two, who owns this PC? Let's just go with I own it. Flip that, next. It's gonna tell me just a moment. That's asking for my email or phone. No account, create one. Uh, let's skip this step. We don't really want to uh, sign in with an Outlook account or email. Let's just make a username. So the username that we will use is test and the password will be test. And the password reminder will be test. Your password hint can't contain your password. What about tests? Okay. Numlock. There we go. That, why? Okay, you know what? Screw it. There. Perfect. Okay, now when me Cortana comes up, you're gonna say not now. You do not want to use Cortana because that is basically like a, a freaking Microsoft Windows spy bot. It will pretty much jump into your computer and be like, yo, can I listen to your voice? Just give me all your voice data and stuff. And I mean, it's, I don't know. You could say that I'm being paranoid or something and you know, maybe I should like wear a tinfoil hat, but seriously, there's just no reason that Microsoft needs all of the information that it is really gathering, which it, it really is nuts. So it's just best to disable as much of Windows as you can, basically. You, you pretty much want to install Windows with the least amount of Windows possible because when you install Windows with the most amount of Windows, that's just more target space for someone to throw a rock and break your Windows. 